My brothers and sisters, I shall now present to you the general authorities and general officers of the Church for your sustaining vote. It is proposed that we sustain President Ezra Taft Benson as prophet, seer, and revelator, and President of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Gordon B. Hinckley as First Counselor in the First Presidency, and Thomas S. Monson as Second Counselor in the First Presidency. Those in favor may manifest it. Those opposed may manifest it. It is proposed that we sustain Marion G. Romney as President of the Council of the Twelve Apostles, Howard W. Hunter as Acting President of the Council of the Twelve Apostles, and the following as members of that council. Marion G. Romney, Howard W. Hunter, Boyd K. Packer, Marvin J. Ashton, L. Tom Perry, David B. Haight, James E. Faust, Neil A. Maxwell, Russell M. Nelson, Dallin H. Oakes, M. Russell Ballard, and Joseph B. Worthlin. Those in favor, please manifest it. Any opposed? It is proposed that we sustain the counselors in the First Presidency and the Twelve Apostles as prophets, seers, and revelators. All in favor, please manifest it. Contrary, if there be any, by the same sign. It is proposed that we sustain the following brethren as additional members of the First Quorum of the Seventy to serve for a period of five years. George R. Hill, John R. Lassiter, Douglas J. Martin, Alexander B. Morrison, L. Alden Porter, Glenn L. Rudd, Douglas H. Smith, and Lynn A. Sorensen. All in favor, please signify. Those opposed may manifest it. Sister Maureen J. Turley has accepted a call to accompany her husband in his assignment as president of the Arkansas Little Rock Mission. It is therefore necessary to release her as first counselor in the Young Women General Presidency. We likewise release Sister Jane B. Malin as second counselor. All who wish to join in an expression of gratitude to these sisters for their devoted service in these respective calls may indicate it by the uplifted hand. Thank you. Sister Ardeth G. Capp, President of the Young Women, has asked Sister Jane B. Malin to serve as her first counselor and Sister Elaine Lowe Jack to serve as her second counselor. Those in favor, please manifest it. Any opposed, by the same sign. It is proposed that we sustain all of the other general authorities and general officers of the Church as at present constituted. Those in favor, please manifest it. Those opposed, by the same sign. President Benson, it appears that the voting has been unanimous in the affirmative. We invite the newly sustained brethren and Sister Jack to take their places on the stand at this time. 